Hunting Connection is brought to you by Deer Quest, The Scent That Smokes. Additional production assistance is provided by World Class Whitetails of Ohio, Carbon Express, Gorilla Gear, Depsot 360, Thermocell, Camillus Knives, D and R Sports Center, Kirby Auto Body, B and M Trailers, and Edge Wraps. Here we go, everybody. If you're looking for a true wilderness trophy bear hunt with a wolf kicker, Frank Martin's of Top Notch Adventures has it all. Located near La Crete, Alberta's last frontier, the bears are big and many. In this show, pro staffer Dave Kirby kills two record book bears. And he gets a big surprise. Here we go. Adventures, La Crete, Northern Alberta. That's where we're at tonight. Uh, new stand location tonight. We're hunting with Frank Martin. He put us in stand number 18. It's way off the beaten path. Quite a long ATV ride. It'll be well worth it. Well, here's my wolf. Last night, uh, you seen it on video, we shot it last night, and uh, you know, the light was a little bit too dark. We were waiting on that big bear to come in. We knew he was there, but I uh, really wanted to show everybody this wolf in, uh, in daylight, show his true beauty. It's just absolutely amazing. Um, perfect opportunity. We knew that big bear was there, so we didn't want to get out of the stand early and take a chance, Frank, but this was awesome. It was really cool and uh, <laughs> yeah, it was pretty cool watching the way it happened. You know, we had that little bear. He was at that barrel. I mean, from the, the minute your quad left, I was putting, I was still strapping in and that, you know, Danny said, hey, there's a bear. So we, we got strapped in and sat down. That bear was there the whole night. Little bugger and uh, he was he was timid. And then uh, this, you know, he, he busted out of there really quick. And uh, you know, we're just, thinking that big bear you said was there. We thought he was gonna come in. And I heard a little a twig snap, looked over right shoulder, and, and this is what was there. I mean, he was he was skittish, but yeah, very skittish. And I'd never dreamed of getting one of these, especially with an arrow. And uh, <clears throat> you know, he skirted the edges a lot, and that little bear had nothing to do with it. He ran off, but kept chomping and you know, trying to trying to spook him off, but this this wolf, he just kept circling the perimeters, trying to wind us or whatever, and did not uh, come into the bait. He did not come into the bait. He kept you know circling around, getting closer and closer, and he was eating all the. You could hear him crunching on the bones and yeah. the remnants of whatever the the bears have drug off the bait, but uh, he did never you know get close. But he got a pretty nice broadside shot. Yeah, he had one opportunity, and I know you know Danny said if you get a chance to to kill it, kill it. Yeah. And he stopped for a split second. You can see on the video, I mean, he was out of there. He, he busted us and he was moving and made it happen. So it was definitely the opportunity of a lifetime. I've always dreamed of getting a wolf and this is the first opportunity I've ever had in my life. So, uh, yeah, we've got a whole bunch of them uh, roaming around at almost all those stands. 
good. Very good, really big. You know, that's what people definitely want to see, and I was excited we didn't get that big bear. We stayed on stand and hoping he would come in. He didn't. We know he's there. Maybe tonight, tomorrow, we'll get him as well. But uh, I'll tell you what, for the hunt of a lifetime, the opportunity, you shoot two bears. Frank does moose hunts as well. Opportunity at a wolf. Um, this is what hunters dream of back in the States is a wolf. I've, this is on my bucket list. I've always wanted to kill a wolf. So you guys want a hunt of a lifetime, top-notch adventures. Frank Martin here, he'll put you on the, he's got some beautiful bears, color phase, a lot of them, a lot of wolves, big moose. He's got it all. Thanks a lot, Frank. Top-notch adventures, Frank Martin, hunt of a lifetime. Bear sense, the scent that smokes. La Crete, Alberta's last frontier. Located in the heart of the legendary Peace River Wilderness area, La Crete is a big game hunting mecca. La Crete is also a strong family community with something for everyone. When you're there, be sure to stop in and say hello at Tough Line Power Sports, Home Hardware, La Crete Co-op, and UFA Petroleum and Convenience. La Crete, Alberta's last frontier. World-class whitetails of Ohio, the name says it all. With the SCI handgun world record, along with the crossbow and rifle world records pending, no one produces giant whitetails like world-class whitetails of Ohio. Located in the hills of Holmes County, in the heart of Amish country, with an airport just a half mile away, World Class Whitetails of Ohio has it all. Give them a call to book your monster buck hunt of a lifetime today. Until now, a tree harness was just for safety, a distraction that interfered with your hunt. The Gorilla Gear GTAC safety harness changes everything with its lightweight design and full range of movement so you can concentrate on the hunt. With a safety tether that's 25% longer for less restriction, more opportunity. Hunting gear shouldn't be a distraction, it should just work. Gorilla Gear, experience the freedom to hunt. A revolution in hunting is about to begin. Choose your weapon wisely. Introducing Maxima Red from Carbon Express, the only arrow engineered to contain and control the enemy of accuracy, dynamic spine, to the red zone. The result is amazing broadhead accuracy and the best hunting arrow ever created. Ready to raise your game? Join the Maxima Red Revolution and shoot better. Carbon Express. Bear sense, the scent that smokes. This portion of Hunting Connection is brought to you by Trophy Taker and Limb Saver. This is our equipment showcase where we talk about the things that help make our hunt a success. You've heard me say it before if you've ever watched my shows, All Bear TV or any of the shows where we show bear hunts. I will not go bear hunting without the thermocell. This right here comes with me no matter what because bear hunts are typically in the buggiest environments in the world. Here in northern Alberta, mosquitoes are off the chain. I won't go in the woods, in the bush, on a bear hunt without the thermocell. Once you're in the woods, there's always a chance if you're bear hunting, or even if you're moose hunting, that you'll come across a bear, an aggressive bear, while on stand, spot and stalk, whatever. We carry the Guard Alaska. Um, it's bear pepper spray, and I'll tell you what, if you touch this off by accident, and it's coming from me, someone who's, who's done that, you'll wish you hadn't. It's 
powerful medicine for an aggressive bear if you get them in the nose and the eyes. You don't want it in your nose or your eyes, I guarantee it. We hunt with Carbon Express's Covert SLS crossbow. It's 360 feet per second. It has a scope. It has everything you need. Their packages are complete with quiver, bolts, everything. Carbon Express, Covert, SLS. It's an accurate, very accurate crossbow. The thing that we light, the thing that we apply to every one of our hunts at the very beginning are the bear scent sticks. It's the scent that smokes. They have all kinds of flavors. Donut, this is donut I have here. And this is anise, the black liquor scent that I have here. They also have honey bacon burn and 12 miles of dead fish, my favorite. But these work, they're oil-based. When they burn, smoke sticks to the leaves. Any place that the wind blows the scent, it sticks there and lasts and lasts and gives the bears a longer lasting trail scent to follow to where we are at the bait site. They'll even work, if you're spotting stalking, if you'll burn them in the areas where you hope the bears come out and stay a little bit, and we've done that in the past too. When David Kirby, my pro staffer, killed the wolf, we had this burning in the perimeter of the, of the stand site to create a giant scent zone. This stuff is sink, stinky. The curiosity, that, that, it's curiosity uh, predator sense for the name of the scent. And uh, you smell it once, you won't be curious no more. But it's for coyote and wolf, and it's very effective. David Kirby shot on that giant timber wolf, and how close it came in, as it was curious, uh, paid off. Curiosity killed. The wolf. These are a few things, everybody, that we took on this hunt to make our hunt a success with top notch adventures in northern Alberta. where he's got a giant Boonum Crockett class, an absolute giant bear. He's figuring about five to 600 pounds. It is nocturnal, it's coming at night. But uh, we put the uh, bear scent sticks out. <coughs> we got them down there burning. Hopefully that'll help draw them out. seen on camera. Mm -hmm. Definitely pushing all oh, 300 pounds. Absolutely amazing. We're uh, about 20 minutes. We've been here about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. He come in. You can hear that. He's 10 mm -hmm. yards. He went 10 yards. Absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. It's a great bear. Well, here he is, my big true king of the north. We uh, stayed on stand late last night trying to get that bigger one, but I wanted to show you this giant in the daylight. He uh, turned out to be a lot bigger than what we thought. He's closer to 400, 
Pope and Young Bear. You can see that big old 20 inch skull on him. He's an incredible, incredible bear. This whole hunt's been absolutely top notch. Man, that timber wolf, that was incredible. I never dreamed of that. He come in close. It was an awesome. Just, I never seen nothing like that. And then to, you know, get one with an arrow. And then we hit this uh, back to stand number five. And you've seen this big one on trail camera that night. So let's hunt him. I think you can get him. And half hour after you were gone, he come in. You guys are absolutely running a top notch. That's where your name comes from. It's incredible up here. So uh, tell everybody how they can get a hold of you, Frank, if they want to, you know, book a hunt of a lifetime like this. Well, they can just log on to my website at uh, www.topnotchadventures.com and uh, we do bear hunts and moose hunts. The bear hunts, the success rate run, a, run 100 percent. The moose with 75 percent. If uh, <clears throat> they want to kill a wolf, we got, it. we got a whole bunch of them too. So if you want to book a hunt, just give me a call. This portion of Hunting Connection is brought to you by Toxonics and Goodyear. You know, it's at the bear station, we burn these bear scent sticks. Just, just, just for insurance. that it's uh, possibly the biggest bear ever in the history of all bear TV. I'm hoping he comes in tonight. If he's playing it by, by last evening, it should be any minute. This is the same stand I shot the wolf out of a few nights ago. So we're gonna sit tight and be quiet and play it as if it's gonna happen any minute. I'm excited to be here. It was absolutely amazing. We got in here and uh, we checked that trail camera pit photos and there was a big one in here, twice the size of the barrels. And uh, that little bear come in and spooked him off. We could hear that thing every step. Ooh, ooh, coming through the timber. And he come up there and that was absolutely amazing. Great shot. Ran over there, tried climbing a tree and then he made a sachet out and 
He went down out there. This has been absolutely amazing. Top-notch adventures. Well, here he is, my last bear of my uh, Alberta hunt up here. This is bear number two. We tagged out up here with uh, top-notch adventures. Frank here, he's got a heck of an operation. Top-notch, definitely, and it's always an adventure. Got a wolf. Uh, you know, this is a great hunt. This was my last hunt. This is the stand I shot the wolf out of as well, but absolutely incredible. This bear came in. You said he was here. We've seen him on trail cams. Said he's a good one, you know. We, we tagged out, and all of them are 300 plus bears. They're just, they're great. And this thing, you know, he's right up there at 300 pounds or better. He's, right. he's got a big old head on him, and I know that two of them we've taken so far were Pope and Young class. This one will measure up, but I bet he's not far off. Right. So that one. this is absolutely a, incredible. So if you guys want a hunt of a lifetime, give Frank here a call, Top Notch Adventures, with Crete, Alberta. It's definitely a place where dreams come true. There's nothing like it. It's awesome. Thanks, Frank. I appreciate it. all your hard work. You guys are definitely top notch. This portion of Honey Connection is brought to you by Chris Hickson Taxidermy and Jeff Tyson Taxidermy. Everybody, this is Frank Martins. He's the owner operator, Top Notch Adventures, here in northern Alberta. And it's a fine operation, a trophy class operation for both bear and moose. We had an epic hunt. We tagged out David Kirby, my pro staffer, and I tagged out with two great record book bears each. And David also killed a wolf. That's not uh, a common thing. It doesn't happen every day with archery equipment. But it was, it was an amazing hunt. The weather cooperated. You got us to stand back and forth safe and sound with a great ride on the Ranger and the ATVs. The stands are bigger than most. They're higher off the ground than most. They're roomy, they're comfortable, they're quiet. You got it all going on here, Frank, and I commend you for that. I've hunted with a lot of outfitters all over Canada and this is one of the best, if not the best, for having everything dialed in to make your hunt comfortable and productive, especially if you're a, a big bear hunter. And that's what we're here for, and it worked out great. The food was fantastic. His wife, Kathy, is the cook. She's really something. You brought us in. You made us feel like family, Frank. We felt like always, family. Always trying to, try to get our clients right into it. It's easy to see that you love to do this and your family's involved too and you know we love your family. You have a beautiful family. Frank, tell everybody how best to get a hold of you as soon as possible if they want to book a, a bear or, or moose hunt or wolf hunt in northern Alberta. Well, if you want to just uh, log on to my website at www.topnotchadventures.com. There's all my information. You can call me or email. Whatever is best for them, guys, just give me a call and we'll uh, arrange a trophy, a trophy uh, hunt. Moose, bear, wolf, it's, uh, it's up to you. And you also have a, a discount, a little a special favor for those who book early, don't you? That's right, Which every time. If there's a big group coming, it'd be a better... Uh, you give them a break with that. You bet. Bring a, a friend or two, he has group rates. Frank Martins. Top Notch Adventures, Northern Alberta. Thank you very much, Frank, for an epic hunt. Dave Kirby and I, my pro staffer, enjoyed it tremendously. Give him a call. Hunting Connection is brought to you by Deer Quest, The Scent That Smokes. Additional production assistance is provided by World Class Whitetails of Ohio, Carbon Express, Gorilla Gear, Depsot 360, Thermocell, Camillus Knives, D and R Sports Center, Kirby Auto Body, B and M Trailers, and Edge Wraps. I've always dreamed of getting a wolf, and this is the first opportunity I've ever had in my life. Open young bear, you can see that big old 20 inch skull on him. He's an incredible, incredible bear.
This is absolutely a incredible. So if you guys want to hunt of a lifetime, give Frank here a call, Top Notch Adventures.